Hello, welcome to oilordering.com. We're going to continue our video series, uh, this time with AMSOIL automatic transmission fluids. Uh, there's quite, uh, uh, there's actually a good selection of products that we have now with automatic transmissions, as you can see here. Of course, we got the two main ATF products the low viscosity, the multi vehicle, and the OE and uh, hiding back here somewhere is the uh, oh yeah uh, the OE for the low viscosity and we also have a couple other things like the quick uh, or the super shift in the CVT transmission fluid I can put that down here too and we also have the super shift which there's that we can go over those too uh, but the main focus is going to be the regular ATF uh, of everything that Amsoil makes, the top three products that they admit, you know, that are the most advanced would be the grease, the severe gear, which I think we've covered that already, and of course the automatic transmission fluids. And they have uh, special staff members up there that just work on doing more research and new, you know, new additives, new base stocks, everything that are out there, and uh, how to make them all work better and and uh, advance the state of the art. And that's what we have here, the most advanced uh, products with the transmission fluid. Now, real quick, on the surface, when a customer comes in here and asks us why they would choose uh, this, or number one question, of course, is which one do they use, but and we'll go over that too. But the AMSOIL automatic transmission fluids will drop temperatures under load, they'll transfer power better, they'll increase the life of the transmission, and then the one unique thing that... Uh, We've got plenty of uh, testimonials on, including third-party magazines even reporting this, is it's reduced or eliminated OEM warranty failures. So these are failures that you wouldn't have had to pay for anyway, uh, but they're such a pain to go back to the dealership and wait on your, for your transmission to get replaced or fixed. The AMSOIL transmission fluid uh, seems to eliminate them. And I'll just start with that. Uh, a couple of years ago, before these fluids were... Um, let's see, upgraded, lubes and greases, let me zoom in here, I think it was May of 2007, this article about the Portland Longshoremen of all sorts of issues that they had, uh, you know, failures and such, and one of the, one of the areas is all their pickups that they bought with Allison Transmissions, it says they went through a number of various, let me make this so you can see it, a number of various uh, fluids. We, uh, nothing worked. We tried a number of fixes, including different filters and oils. Nothing worked, and the problem was compounded by the fact that it took so long to see results. Uh, sooner or later, right there, we went with AMSOIL PAO-based uh, transmission fluid, and they haven't lost a transmission yet. And this was a big fleet. This was the Portland uh, Longshoreman fleet. Uh, they don't say exactly how many vehicles because they're talking about, well, it says 530 uh, pieces of equipment with 17 different classifications. So we're talking about all sorts of uh, things there. But that was published in Lubes and Greases. Uh, other, other than that, though, <clears throat> I get a lot of, most of our customers are repeat customers, and they'll use this, whether it's a Toyota or a full-size Dodge diesel or something like that. And... Uh, Whatever the transmission problem is, they always report back uh, more than I hear from the other products on uh, how well it worked for them. <clears throat> a lot of times it's just a loss in power transfer that they've noticed. Like I had a Toyota customer about 20,000 miles. It was some type of lifetime fluid. And in a forum, too, they discussed the fact that it just wasn't working after about 20,000 miles. They switched to the AMSOIL, and uh, they said the shifting and the overall... Uh, feel of the transmission improved and of course mileage improves with that as well so that was with the uh, the low viscosity product that meets that specification uh, another the, the most common one though I have is uh, shifting hesitation and problems and that occurs when uh, the problem ox the, the product or you know the, the one they had in there before oxidizes and it uh, you know, as it ages, it loses its frictional properties, 
and that's how you get the poor shift quality. Well, the computer tells the transmission to shift gears, and it, you know, it squeezes plates together inside a clutch pack. Uh, if the frictional properties are wrong, the computer will compensate, and then over time, uh, as it degrades, you'll have jerky or in, uh, inconsistent shifts. Well, just switching to AMSOIL instantly fixes that. And the amazing thing about that is a lot of customers aren't prepared to do a flush, and they'll just do a drain and top off, which involves you know anywhere from four to seven quarts. So it might be 25 to 40 percent of the fluid and all that power comes back when you do that you always do want to change the filter if there is one so it doesn't even require a full flush now if you go to our website oilordering.com and look up the automatic transmission fluids uh... amsel took it down on their site because i couldn't find it but i still have the procedure on doing a full flush yourself and I'm gonna reach hold on one second I'm gonna reach over and grab something to put in front of the camera this product right here is the engine and transmission flush and uh, this will actually uh, it's very it's a very mild non solvent type of a flush so if you follow that procedure that we have online, oilordering.com, just look up the ATF products to see the PDF in there. Uh, it shows you how you can do it yourself. You put that fluid in, and then when you're ready to flush, you use the uh, line that goes to the oil cooler uh, as the exit. And then uh, as it's after you've run the flush and changed your filter and put your pan back on, you're basically adding fluid as it's uh, hydraulically being pushed out of that line that you disconnected. So it's all covered in that uh, PDF. Uh, another thing is, uh, let me pull something over here. This is this little piece of paper here, this Las Vegas taxi cab field study. Uh, these products, both the Amsoil ATF and in this case the 0W20, I think they were Ford Crown Victorias, uh, 180,000 miles or just over 180,000 miles. The uh, let me see if I can show you some things here. No discoloration, and they never had uh, faulty shift patterns any time during that. But this uh, this whole document covers the transmission cleanliness and uh, shift patterns and and uh, wear. Oh, here's the here's the proof in the pudding right here. Uh, they show the Mercon upper and lower limits, and typically a transmission fluid frictional properties will go beyond the lower limit. That's why you get the problems with the shifting. Well, over 180,000 miles, 183,705, there was almost no change in the frictional uh, properties. Right there, that alone is the reason the extra $2 for a, a quart of this is worth it. Um, there's also the engine area, which all you got to do if you go to amsoil.com, or I think I have it on my website, I'll put it up there if it's not, oilordering.com. You just look up this part number. You do a search for the G3118. Again, G3118. And you'll find that document, the Las Vegas Taxi Cab Field Study. Or just give us a call, 800-579-0580. And uh, we can look that up. Let me see. There was something else here. Of course, the data sheets uh, you can download off the site, oilordering.com. And on the back, just like on the lookup guide on our website, you'll find a lookup guide that will find the right transmission fluid. All the applications, the specifications that your transmission require will direct you to the right product. Um, on that note... Before about 2001, we had a just a regular ATF that was called Universal. Well, when newer transmission fluids came out, they were lower viscosity. We had to come up with one, and this has a peel label where there's more information inside, by the way. We had to have another fluid to meet the newer uh, specs that were coming out, like the uh, Mercon SP and Dexron uh, specs. Uh, let's see, we got a couple of the 
Mercon 5, Dextron 3, the older ones, Chrysler ATF Plus 4. Uh, it's all sorts of other Mazda, Hyundai, Texaco, Volkswagen, Suzuki. There's just a number of uh, characteristics here that need to be met on the, uh, the older one. And then the newer uh, ATF, the low viscosity, is your Mercon LV SB, the Dextron 6, and then a number of European models, uh, the Honda DW1, which I think is made to be backward compatible, Toyota World Service, which is uh, probably or probably second biggest lead of demand with this, and then several other Volkswagen, Mitsubishi, uh, and over-the-road trucking specifications listed on there. But you can go to look that up. Uh, the other thing I wanted to cover here is some people use it as an additive. Like I said, small shift problems. They come into our store saying, hey, do you have a transmission additive? They mention other competing products. And basically what I'll state is, well, just use our quart of oil in place of whatever other additive is sold out there. And there you go. You just prove that that expensive additive that another company puts a label on is just a superior transmission fluid. I wouldn't be surprised if it's actually our product that they just put their label on and they call it some type of a remedy. Uh, also, if you notice, we have this OE line of products, the original equipment. Those are about $2 to $3 less than the, uh, you know, the original uh, signature series. And basically, those were made uh, for drivers to go to installers who have little knowledge in transmission fluid, but the installer wants to use an AMSOIL product, but it's difficult for that installer to upsell the benefits of AMSOIL. That's not what they're there for. They want to sell something with the AMSOIL name. It has to be profitable. So they came up with a, a transmission fluid where we're not boasting all of our testimonials, but at least this is the equivalent or better than the OEM fluid with the AMSOIL name, you always know you're going to get a better base stock, and it's a synthetic base. So it, it doesn't quite reach all the, uh, you know, the, the testimonials that this is going to get, the benefits that this is going to give, but at least it's one that will compete on price. So if you're just doing a secondary car, maybe selling a car, it needs new fluid, uh, but uh, you still want a superior product than over-the-shelf, over-the-counter type products. Or uh, another use, which I sell mostly this one for, is for transfer cases. A transfer case uh, usually doesn't require the fluid power benefits that an ATF, a hydraulic fluid, needs. It's being used in that case as a gear oil, so might as well not spend the extra money and just use the OE. Uh, and you can call us anytime about that if you need to order, of course. I'm always here Monday through Friday and on Saturdays, certain hours. Uh, 800-579-0580. Uh, and that's really all I have to cover. Again, oilordering.com or syntheticwarehouse.com. Be glad to help you. And uh, hope you enjoyed this video on the AMSOIL automatic transmission fluids.